He's so we'll the... give him a check mark on this one. Yeah, we. I think this is a good one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think it's like an this accurate. This show is so review. weird. So just just to make sure the audience is still with us here, these are reviews written by a man who would eventually become like the lead English propagandist for Al Qaeda. Yes. 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 Great. Continue. And and because we have to be judgmental, we're judging his taste in metal. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. Yeah. To to see whether he was always a poser. Yeah. Or if he actually knew his metal. Or I'm, if he I'm beginning okay. to think that it's the latter, but we'll see. <laughs> yeah, I think he's he's a look, man, he cuz he wasn't when when you see him he's not so much a jihadist as like a dork for jihad, you know. Yeah. And I yes. can see yeah. him taking yeah. that same energy to metal. Easily. It's important to point out that so with the way that he talk, talks about this um all, all these uh and he has, I think, he has seven reviews in this, or maybe five reviews in this, uh, in this zine. And uh, he mentions in one of the reviews that he was like started listening to met, like uh, death metal and gore grind or whatever, like a year prior to writing these reviews. Yeah. But he talks about it with kind of an, with an element of like uh, yeah understanding. So I could imagine that he kind of dove right into when he found when he discovered metal. He probably dove right in and developed a sort of encyclopedic knowledge of that. Probably did yeah. the same yeah, to I mean, jihad. He says later that when when he was became a Muslim, he said that he was obsessed with death metal. So yeah, this looks this sounds like someone who's scouring obscure message boards for. But this is also yeah. like so you know he's not he's not a fanboy right. He didn't jump on the jihadi ship right after nine eleven like the rest of them. Right. No, no, yeah. he fucking did the deep cut. Yes. 1995 Pakistan, <laughs> like 1996 <laughs> Afghanistan. Yeah. You know, before yeah, it was right. popular, before it was like, cool. Know. Yeah, and it's, also I think uh, the war in Bosnia and Chechnya was uh, uh, like important to him. No, I mean, that, yeah, that was the time when he became a Muslim, and it was a big thing in the news. Yeah, and I, and I mean, I think in the U.S., I mean, there wasn't so much of a drive to you know become a jihadist and go to Chechnya or yeah. or Bosnia but it was definitely a thing in, in Europe and mm. and um, of course you know the Middle East and um, yeah because as we know foreign lots of foreign fighters went especially to Chechnya but also to Bosnia mm. yeah Fritz here this has been a highly manipulative attempt to entrap you into our Patreon page at patreon.com slash tenipod to subscribe and get the full premium episode we've teased here. Also check out our Twitter account, also at tenipod, and follow us, subscribe, and get the latest updates as well as whatever garbage falls out of our brains. So we cool?